Todd Chrisley starving behind bars. Dead cat, expired food, and mold. Hello everyone, my name is Alana B. Welcome back to my another video. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. Todd Chrisley of Chrisley knows best reveals that he and the other inmates are starving behind bars. Sitting down for a fun interview with Brian Enton from News Nation, the disgraced reality TV star spilled all sorts of shocking tea on what mealtime behind bars looked like. Brian asked Todd if he could talk about what the food situation looked like. He clarified that his daughter Savannah talked about the food a little bit. Brian, however, wanted to know if the food was even safe for consumption. Seemingly laughing at the question, Todd immediately told him that the food was so disgustingly filthy. Todd Chrisley proceeded to explain the first problem with the food behind bars is that everything is expired. Sadly, the inmates are not served food that isn't at least a year past its expiration date. Furthermore, Todd claims that there are rats and squirrels in the storage room where they keep the food they serve. Likewise, they used plastic to cover the food while they ripped out the ceiling to deal with the black mold. During the mold removal process, a dead cat fell from the ceiling and landed on the food they were serving people. Todd adds that he questions if the inmates are even served 1,000 calories a day behind bars. For this reason, he argues they are trying to starve everyone in here to death. He only eats from the commissary. Todd Chrysley added that he will only eat what he can purchase and cook on his own. This means his diet largely consists of peanut butter and tuna. He, however, does sometimes get pasta from the commissary and makes a pasta salad as well. Unfortunately, he believes the warden has significantly reduced what could be purchased from the commissary to try and break him. Without reason, inmates went from being able to purchase 12 cans of tuna to 6 and then to 3. When Todd asked why, he was told that being a commissary was a privilege, not a right. Sadly, he was given no real answer on why the provisions were cut so dramatically. Todd Chrisley is getting by only eating what he can purchase from the commissary, open, and put together himself. He, however, feels for the inmates who don't have the funds to make the same purchases he can. Sadly, he believes the facility is trying to starve everyone to death. Furthermore, Todd concluded this section of the interview by claiming the reason why would not let Brian Enton from News Nation into the facility had nothing to do with security. They just couldn't risk a media outlet seeing the actual conditions of the facility. Reality star Todd Chrisley, jailed for bank fraud and tax evasion, says his federal prison has unsafe food, mold, and a dead cat fell out of the ceiling onto the food. The prison denied me access to interview him, but I was able to ask Chrisley questions through his lawyer. Do you think what Todd Chrisley said about the food situation is true? Share your thoughts in the comments, and keep coming back for more news and updates on the Chrisley family. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel, America Trends 24, and stay with us.